forced to go outside. I'm being forced to go into public and leave the house and my room and just stop being introverted. So that is what we did on a fine Saturday morning. All of us went and got on our bikes because instead of being a normal family and taking the car for like 10 minutes, we decided to take a two hour bike ride instead because you know, that's what we do. Arriving at the first destination, we have some statutes. Seeing all these statutes reminded me that actually I don't have a statute. And that's just, that's just kind of sad. But you know what's even more sad? I went to climb this statue to get a picture, you know, me, adventurous tree climber and just generally a very athletic person. And you know, I made it up just fine, but I thought it was a little bit challenging. Then you look behind to see the five-year-olds climbing it at ease. Like what? The audacity to make me look bad. She needs to be cancelled right now. Then for the next destination, there was some fair kind of thing going on. And the army was there with some army cars and some tanks. This was also a scary experience for me. Not because of the army and the tanks, but because of social activities. There was so many people there. Luckily, however, I did not make eye contact with a single person. But as you can see, apparently COVID has just disappeared. COVID is no longer here. Then we also saw some strange swampy ass looking water but instead of the true king and queen shrek and fiona they just had actual king and queen how lame then they also had some tall legged people walking around which is kind of rude and offensive to my five foot four height it made me feel very insecure and very short However, the day was redeemed by this drastic moment. I was scared. I was nervous. I was preparing myself for the worst. But I managed to gather the strength and took the initiative. I approached them. I stood there and I posed. And just like that, the moment was captured. But there's more. After my insane amount of awkwardness, you thought it couldn't get worse. But oh, it did. I had to go back for round two. This time closer this time more personal. I stood there amongst the line of tiny children and a baby, and I politely awaited for my turn to come. Then when he least expected it from a 19 year old adult girl, I struck down. And ladies and gentlemen, I high-fived someone in public. Yes, it was an inanimate object, but let's not talk about that. Then oddly enough, the army was distributing some water. This was not any kind of water, however. No bottled water. No, water in bags. A bag of water. So obviously we need to cop one and try it out. It was definitely nice and cold. However, conveniency an absolute zero. Then as for the taste, I went and took a sippy sip and it was not that great. Then moving along to the city center, I crossed the road with Ease. And I totally, absolutely did not look awkward at all whatsoever. Look at me just being and acting very natural. Like definitely no one is filming me at all. And I am definitely not feeling at all self-conscious and just embarrassed. Then Lady trapped me in a bit, but that's okay, we persevere. I went and strolled my bike along the busy streets of Budapest until I found yet again another statue because we love statues. Me and inanimate objects, we just go together. Because you know, at least statues are not gonna start talking to me. And I like that. However, even hugging a statue proved some difficulty. Just look at the awkwardness naturally oozing out of this frame. It literally pains me to watch. And yes, then I also slapped him. Then I continued to scrut scrut on my bike and got attacked by a wasp but I went some circles because I like to go circles as you can see beautiful buildings in the background I did nearly run over a person but what's new that's just the usual Then yet again being very natural and not awkward at all I did a nice jump Wow so much skill Then here's a little montage of me riding my bike next to the trolleys next to the buildings and just being very not awkward again i'm just not an awkward person then i took off because i had enough once arriving back at home we had some kfc we had some fries had the chicken strips and they even had onion rings doing leg day after a 20k bike ride yesterday and with a sore throat um was not really the best decision
look at my abs. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. Look at my gloves. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. Good morning, everyone. It's 5 p.m. This morning, I woke up actually pretty late at like 8 o'clock instead of 7. I know, crazy, revolutionary, drastic change, and it's not okay. It's definitely not okay. In fact, it did completely ruin my entire day. But I needed the sleep because recently I've been running on like six hours of sleep. So that's not very ideal and I am exhausted physically and mentally, more so mentally. And for that reason, I also decided to try out meditation. There's a wasp trapped in my window. Whoa! 